I deem myself as a practicing Muslim. I deem myself as, thankfully, a well-educated Muslim. And I deem that grooming gangs are 100% against Islam, 100%... I'll ask you the question one more time, Joe. Does not the notion that stoning adulteresses to death or lashing fornicators, which is in the Quran, the lashing of the fornicators, I quoted it for you in Arabic, does that not notion contribute to looking down on women? Are you a Muslim? Yes, I am. But do, do, what, what, how do you interpret these verses then? Well, I'm, I'm saying that we can't implement them, we have to suspend them, we have nothing to do with those attitudes in this day and age. That is an out of date notion. What do you say? So, what does lashing a woman. Joe, can you answer my question? Gang? For God's sake, answer the question, man. What? Okay, what listen. Well, let me. In an ideal Islamic state, when all the Sharia conditions are met and it's all, you know, Sharia appliant and compliant, is it still wrong to stone an adulterous woman to death? I think, I, obviously, if that's not part of the law of the land, then then that's not the way I would go about it. But no, no, I'm saying in a Sharia state where it is the law of the land and all the Sharia conditions are compliant, would you morally object to stoning an adulteress to death who's been found guilty in a Sharia court? I, I, I'm not in a position to answer that. I'm not a scholar to answer that. There we are. You need a scholar to tell you that it's wrong to stone a woman to death? Joe. You have just exposed yourself to the nation as the apologist that I suspected you were from the beginning of this call. The reason you are taking offence at me exposing some of this is because deep down inside you, you can't even bring yourself as a human being to condemn the notion of stoning a woman to death just because some man who's got a medieval scripture stuck in his head hasn't told you that it's wrong. Would, how would you react if I said to you, that, and you asked me, is it wrong to torture a baby, and I said to you, I don't know, because the Pope hasn't told me yet. You'd think I'm subhuman. You'd think I'm inhuman, Joe.